people. Now, one thing that I haven't done a lot of automations and stuff with um, with the drums on this track, and I kept it really simple, is because I love to do something that's this, the remix. I'm not going to do it, but you guys can have a lot of fun with it. <laughs> so, because mainly in, the, in these Nero half tempo tracks, the the drums and reversing drums and all that, so I'm just going to show you in this case i have all of this in the master so it's controlling uh, drums and and the basses but you can do like one in the drums and just add one here and one for the basses and the different stuff but this what it is is the remix effects and it's like a multi effects uh, thing so let's play just the drums for now and you guys will see So as you can see, it's a lot of fun, <laughs> and uh, and then you can just automate this, uh, just play record and play along with it, and so it's a lot of fun. And you can see with the basses, it's also really cool. So let's go with it all together, just to show you guys, and we'll play it one more time, and we're done for this one. So, as you guys can see, it was not my best performance, <laughs> but there's a lot of fun and you can do a lot of things. So, this would be something to do after you do all the stems, you, you bounce everything, you export all the tracks, or at least these tracks, and then do it in another project, adjust what you have to adjust, because sometimes, as you notice here, it plus some highs or some stuff, and then you can always do small adjustments but it might be easier a new project with the track finish and then just play along with it and go around with it and it's a lot of fun so yeah this was it for the Nero half tempo drum programming i hope you guys had fun in all these videos uh this is it for now just charm in the next video for a small conclusion and i'll see you in the next videos okay <laughs>